Look at the face. That is a freaking Rolex. So we just got back from the pallet auction. Guess what? We just learned the hard way. You don't get to keep the boxes. So here's our pallet of everything just kind of thrown together. We paid 40 bucks for it. We got a couple other things I'll show you later, but this is the main thing. $40 for this stuff here. Do we get a good deal? Do we get ripped off? Let's find out. Not even gonna lie, I'm childish. The reason we wanted the unit is because we could see the Pikachu plushie at the top. And you know, Pikachu's good things. Pikachu means good stuff. You realize what you just yeah. said? What? The reason we wanted the unit. <laughs> I'm an autopilot. Man. I know. Auto what storage unit? The pallet. Yeah, storage unit. <laughs> this would have went for seven thousand dollars right now. But look at the first thing you got. All right. It's toolbox. pretty beat up, but it's a metal toolbox and the little thingies work. Let's see if it has an inside. And it does. So hey, I mean, it's not in the greatest shape, but if you put metal tools in a metal toolbox, that's likely to happen. So that's something cool. Whoever uses the umbrella. toolbox is not going to care. Do I open the umbrella? See if it works. Yeah. Let's see. Open an umbrella. It's a good one. Good big one. It's red and black too. It's my favorite color. So, does this count as indoors? All right. It no. just auto opens. You see that? <laughs> yeah. I didn't even do nothing. Does it not close? Is that what it is? Look. Yeah. All right. So then. It's, it's just tied down. It's got to be tied <laughs> down, or it just auto opens and blows up in your face. So, <laughs> all right. That's cool. Let's get this thingy back closed. Close enough. There's a lot. I saw quite a few like diapers in these. So look at this. Underwear. Underwear, underwear, diapers, they're diapers. Yeah, diapers. <laughs> <laughs> These, then king size mattress pad. Nice. Yep, that's in there. This was one of the things we bought separately, right? Five bucks. Yeah, this one for five bucks, and this is just a clothes rack that's pretty much new in the box. The reason we wanted this because um, Poshmark stuff, we're kind of running out of closet space and needed this, and figured not gonna get it cheaper than five dollars nope. anywhere else, and it's all in the box. So good deal. Five bucks for that. This wine glass thing i'm pretty sure this comes from walmart but it was in the pallet so i didn't pay nothing extra for it and look at that they're all perfect shape brand new. so that's pretty cool yeah pretty much brand new there a lot of this stuff we bagged up because it was just a lot of smaller stuff but we'll get to that soon yeah. we'll bag up because it was in the back of the truck we don't want it flying away yeah these are like a lot of little jars actually. people yeah. for some reason Buy, always buy our jars like right away at yard sales. I don't know what they use them for. Maybe crafting or something crafting, like that. Crafting, organization. Something like that. But they always, people always buy them. And if we can get two for a dollar, I mean, that's like five or six bucks in this box right here. Sit. Don't break. Don't break. Yep. You almost broke it. Me? <laughs> yeah. I didn't touch it. So what is this? <laughs> Velocity gears are like fighting? Take it out. Martial arts stuff? Or another sport? sport? Uh, what do you think? I don't know. That's definitely you not fighting. Take it out? I mean, I can try. Let's see, see if it's like shoulder pads or something. It's not football. It's not martial <laughs> martial arts. Those are the only two sports I've done in my life, so I can't help you on that. Uh, goalie. Somebody help hockey us goalie. Out? <laughs> I Anybody? have no idea. Anybody? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Another thing I know is worth a lot of money. I'm pretty sure people use these when like fishing. So check that out. It's got the boots. And everything. I think it's Cabela brand too. It looks like you have a friend when I just hey. focus on the boots. This is me and my homie right here. I call him nobody. <laughs> he's nobody, literally. He's got nobody. But he's look how long his waist is, man. Look at this guy. Yep. He goes, well, I'm pretty sure it's what you wear like spender so you can walk in the water and like fish. Isn't cool. that called is it fly fishing? No, I don't Somebody know. out there will correct me. You guys know I don't. So speaking of outdoors, oops. We got this 110 here, Great Land Outdoors. And apparently, they're all names on it. <laughs> this feels like a storage unit. Yeah, it does. <laughs> this is as close we're gonna get right now. I'm guessing this might be a sleeping bag with that. Let's check it out. Oh, Ben, you. So, yeah. Another yep. sleeping bag? Kind yeah, of or it might thing. be a chair. I don't know what it is. Let's find oh. out. I thought you had it. No. <laughs> what is it? Eureka Apex. That something that me. goes to something. Thank you. That was the most informative <laughs> knowledge I've heard all day today. Something that goes with something. You yes. know what? Exactly. All right, which back should I rip into? This one. This one right here? I'm pulling it over here. Break the jars. You did that. That was your fault. That was your fault. I was testing your reflexes to see if you'd catch them. Okay. All right, let's see what's in this bag. Because I did not go through this at all. We literally just put a bag, dump, put a bag, dump, put a bag, dump, put a bag, dump until we got it all out empty. So let's see what's in the bag. Beauty. 
that, Missy. <laughs> so, hey, look, blood pressure monitor. Nice. That's not even, I don't know if this has even been opened. Or actually, it might have been. No, it's still in the plastic. So, cool. It might be a brand new blood monitor. Worth a little something. A flag. America. <laughs> some sunglasses. Some glasses. Yeah, what brand are these? Any Ray Bans? They're Slate Slazinger. Mm. Slazinger. Mm. Let's put this flag somewhere. I'll put it right here for now. Uh, dolphin. What is this big boy? Look at this picnic, picnic time. time. Huh. Never seen anything like that. A blanket tote. Does it got a price tag on it? No, it doesn't, but it's heavy duty, so this box is heavy. That's kind of cool. And I told you I saw quite a few diapers in here. I'll probably just end up donating the diapers, honestly, since I don't know what to do with them. I don't even know if you resell them, but whatever. We'll just <laughs> we got them. it just to donate it back. Yeah, not to <laughs> but Goodwill. But not, not to Goodwill. Not to Goodwill, yeah. That Regent, this guy from um, Paw Patrol? Yes. Paw Patrol, all right. Dragon costume. PJ Masks. Not bad. Look at this. It's like a little gift basket. It's got like it's spa basket. stuff in there. I see brushes. Maybe there's something like soap or spongy inside there. Not sure. Another monkey. Oh, this is an NBA or college basketball monkey. NCAA Final Four. So that could be collectible just because it's college basketball. Um, of course, I would find this book in there out of all books. <laughs> <laughs> what is this one? Ooh. Check that out. This is joy. All right. Joy to the world, guys. Joy, joy to the world. To the world. Uh, that. Place that. Stitched art, maybe? Yeah. Look at that. Looks like something somebody stitched together. Kind of cool. All right, so. What is that? A straightener? Or curler? curler? Something to do with it's a hair. good question. <laughs> Crab claws. I don't know. Is it? It's either. Sh I don't know what it is. It, it looks has like to a be straightener. A curler. It's got to be a curler. Yeah, I agree. This. You know what this reminds me of? I see it. Oh look, it's new. It's a jewelry organizer, hanging jewelry organizer. Nice. For twenty bucks, actually. Cool. But it reminds me of who remembers having these in high school? It had all the calculators in them. This is at least <laughs> in high school. They always had these hanging in the door in math class. With all the calculators. The Fault in Our Stars. This is a brand, brand new, new. Blu-ray. Not bad. One of these, you never have too many of these. I feel right. like you always need them. When you, An orange one. When you have them, you don't need them. And when you don't have them, you always need them. That's how those things work. Uh, what is that? Rainbow Tutu what? Rainbow Tutu. All right, a rain it looks like a tutu actually. So that, this is brand new. Michelle G. Robinson, never heard of her. Uh, well, why is she so? Why is this thing so heavy? To sit, probably. That thing. Feel the bottom of it. It's like heavier than you would think. Oh. <laughs> I don't know why it's so heavy at the bottom. I guess it's like you said, so it'll sit up. Draft. Glass. Oh look, somebody. This looks like what you had to do in art class every time you made something out of clay. They're like, put your initials in the year on there. It's good though. Yeah, it is better than anything I ever made. What is that big boy here? Insurance supplied pumping style. Oh, double breast pump. pump. Yeah, I'm not touching that. But maybe this is also something that we might just donate because somebody might need these. So I don't know. I don't know really know what they sell for to be honest. Uh, that looks like it goes to it. Mm-hmm. This looks like one of those little art guys. Yeah. Mini version. Draw it. <laughs> Put it in any position yeah. and draw it. I can draw a stick man. That's about the extent of my skill when it comes to drawing. A bag, and what's in the bag is the question. Come out. All right, so we got a few weird things in here. Get, get out, get, there's something else in here, but what's this first? Goggles, anything in the case? No, nope, just the white for your glasses. There's something else in here that I can't seem to figure out where it is. There's a front pocket. It's oh, is it? The zipper. Oh, okay. That's why I can't find it. it. Makes sense now. It is, what is that, bug spray? Yep. Great, <laughs> bug spray. <gasps> Chuck E. Cheese token ah. tickets before they went to the machine, and I just found money. A quarter. A see? quarter. They don't check everything. <laughs> uh, but oh, these are nostalgic. These are when Chuck E. Cheese was good before they made it all digital. And you used to get these and you hit the jackpots and just have a giant pile of tickets. It just made it more fun. You had to uh, carry around the bag. Yes, yeah, so when you had to get the bag from the front, you know you're just like that kid. Let me get the bag at the front <laughs> for my tickets. More tickets here, and hey, I found a quarter. All right, this I'm still keeping. Thumbtacks, always need those. You guys see in your walls. 
Looks like a toy store in there. Oh boy, a, a cup. cup. Yeah, and I can get kicked <laughs> in the... You know what? What is that? Look at this. White House Historical Association Christmas Order from 2003. Huh. So this must have been when uh, Bush was in office, right? Look at that. It's kind of cool. Cool. I wonder how collectible these things are. I hmm, don't know. I don't know either. Let's set that over there. And what else do we have in here before we go to the next bag? Stuffed animal. He's cool looking. Uh, this guy's a beanie baby. Look, see his tag? Yep. A horse. And a dirt bike. What's in this? Like a shower kit? Mm-hmm. I don't think it's been used. <laughs> Chalk! Woo! A rattlesnake! Da -da -da -da. Oh, let's put that on the floor, mess with the cat. Oh yeah, I'm definitely gonna do that. <laughs> There's, um, what's her name? I forgot. Elsa? Elsa. If I'm right. I, I think. Know. That sounds right. A microphone. Oh, it even has an aux cable. Oh yeah, we're gonna plug this up and have rap battles later. <laughs> then one more little beanie maybe and whatever this is in this bag. Huh, that's a cool bag. Next bag, first thing we see, this I think fell out of the first one that I missed. It's like handmade fine soap. Casey's Angel Soaps. Okay, soap, soap. We'll use it. Let's see what's in this one. Oh, your favorite. Yeah, hey, they're actually new though. Okay, Look. that's not bad. Though. This is okay. If it's new in the thing, all right, this wire is coming with it, but <laughs> whatever it is, it's 10 pack of hangers that are new. What is this? This is like an alarm clock. What is this? Oh, another hanger. Heavy duty. Jose Bank hanger. <laughs> Ooh, fancy, huh? Uh, dog. Dolphin. <laughs> uh, that. A bunny. Yeah. Uh, an actual, like, this one feels porcelain. Have a date on her, not that I see. Not on the neck, it says. On the neck, it's, like, marked in pen. C7663. That's strange, like, somebody hand wrote that. I don't know if that's a code for something, but it's there. Hey, look, little target dog dressed as a pencil. <laughs> oh, here's another Jose Bank hanger. Woohoo! Racket it in. This thing. Ooh. It's a bigger one. Poodle. Poodle. Another brass out. This one has body wash in it. So that. Uh, there's a lot of stuff in here. A lot of stuffed animals. Yeah. Unicorn. <laughs> uh, oh, look. Bluebird pie. It looks like an old pie dish. I Interesting. Wonder. That's cool. Oh, gosh. I found something breakable. <sighs> you know, every single time in my life I've attempted this, I've tried for about 45 seconds and threw it at the wall. <laughs> I can get one side. I don't uh, understand how one you more get. more than me. 12 weeks of laundry freshness, like detergent type stuff. Uh, let's see, well, whatever this is. A bag of string. Simple American cooking cookbook. Uh, what is this, picture frame or picture album? Ugh, they take people's pictures out of it. Yeah, there's not in there. What about this book? This looks like it could be old. Let's see what it is, what do you think? Something cool? Mm, yeah. God's, what? Psychiatry. There you go. Good Psychiatry. Job. I'm proud of you. <laughs> Psychiatry. <laughs> Psychiatry. I don't yeah. know. Uh, Ooh. Book bag. A little tie cool dye color. too. Yep. Puma. Nothing in there that I see or feel. Um, let's see. Let's see. Where else? They look sunglasses. They're kind of busted though, and they're brandless, so not gonna be worth much. What about this? The Ordeal of the Reunion, A New History of Reconstruction. All right, that book. Hey, look. Golf balls, we gotta save it for the guy at the yard too. I know, a whole <laughs> bag of like probably 10, 15 golf balls. All right, this thingy is a speaker. What's in here? So like, a little new stuff. play thing? Yeah, it looks new. What is this though, plates? Oh, it's this. A burner cover. Set of four burner covers. So I guess your stove doesn't look all grimy. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Hey, look, a VHS. We're making it big now. <gasps> Hocus, Hocus Pocus. Pocus. Such a good movie. I've never seen it. <laughs> uh, what is this? Pretty Kitty Lives Here. <laughs> this is not going up. <laughs> not going up. looks like Dexter. Not going up. <laughs> uh, whatever this is. You are love beyond measures. Like a little spoon. Probably for like a baby shower gift. Something like that. One of those things you They're get for your baby cups. shower. Oh, it looked like a baby spoon. It said you are loved on it. Yeah. 
All right. You are love beyond measure. Oh. <laughs> oh. It's one of those gifts you're like, thank you, and then you put it in a drawer or closet and it never comes out. Yeah. Dog. <laughs> what is this? You just want me the guy from Family Guy. Yeah. Oh. 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 <laughs> These glasses like actually match the glasses case. So that's kind of cool. And it's got the rag in it, but they're probably prescription, so they're not going to be no good. Probably just donation. Love bug. That's what they look like, huh? <laughs> uh, what else is in here? What else? What else? What else? Ooh, boy. So many socks. Yay. <laughs> uh, let's see. Whoa. Mm -hmm. book. What happened to this doll's head, oh, man? Oh, her hair's gone. Yeah, her hair's completely gone. But this one's another porcelain, definitely. It's even got the stand with it. But yeah, not only is her hair gone, her entire scalp's gone. Mm. All right. <laughs> Anything else? I see a lot of books. I see a panda and what's that? A router type thing. Look these up. Some of these are worth money. So we've sold, remember a while back we found like probably 30 or 40 of these on eBay. We sold all of them on eBay except for two. That's the only two we had left. So 30 out of 40 is a good rate. Other than that though, anything in here? No, it's empty. The rest of it looks like books and just random knickknacks. So like I said, we bought the unit because I saw Pikachu and I was hoping there'd be other Pokemon stuff in there. And look what I see. I think his name's Blastoise, if I remember correctly. I, have no I know idea. it's the evolved version of Squirtle. I haven't watched Pokemon or played it in ages. I used to love the card game when I was in like second and third grade, but I think it's Blastoise. Then we got Mickey Mouse. <laughs> you said unit again, by the way. Did I really? Yeah. Jeez. <laughs> you know, when you do 400 videos one way and you do one another way, it's kind of right. hard. Right. Bear. This bear smells like a dog. I'm going to throw him over there. Uh. Mm. Any other stuffed animals? I just think it's interesting. Dalmatian. Cat. Interesting looking cat. Is that Clifford? Oh no, it's a bear. A devil bear. Oh, he's satanic. What else is in there though? Is that Scooby? Scooby it looks like Scooby a collar. His collar. Yeah. I think it's Scooby Doo missing his collar. Scooby's a stray now. <laughs> yeah, a couple more stuffed animals. That's all that's in that one. Alright, let's get into this bag now. Yeah. Oh man, it's plastic. What's it made out of? I tied it well. Titanium alloy? <laughs> All right, so we got this green. Whoa, did you hear that? Sounds like a gunshot. Green basket. This is, oh, look at this. Gallery craft stitcher. Somebody stitched that. That's kind of cool. That's pretty good. Cool. Look at this. What is this? An eel. Oh, I thought it was Shenron. I thought it was a dragon. <laughs> it's an eel. All right. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Now, what else is in there, though? Trash, thanks. That dog? A pug. A what? Pug. Pug life. This is one of the other things I saw in there I wanted to get, even though I'm a Yankees fan and hate the Red Sox. I know they're one of the most popular teams out there, so. Yeah. Little Boston Red Sox there. Uh, this. Book bag's empty. Oh, I like the colors. Yeah. Is this Coca Cola bear? No, it's just a regular Flannel. Coca Cola bear. His name Huffington or something. Hug Fun. Probably just something random. Check this out. Thermo pad, thermoputic heat and cold pad. And this is in the box. This is heavy. Well. So that's cool. <laughs> Another Mickey Mouse. <laughs> Two Mickeys. Uh, this is maybe mm. a poncho, I think. Maybe. That's what it feels like. What's in here, though? That's oh, the real question. Bag of stuff. So, Cleo and Friends nesting cats. It's like those things that go inside of each other, it looks like. And you open up and make smaller and smaller and smaller. Yeah. That thing. All right. What, a vent? A vent, yep. It's new. All right. I always need a new vent. <laughs> uh, these look like maybe little things that sit on your desk that like hold paperwork and files. I don't know. My whole picture frame. Maybe that too. What are these? Like knobs? These look like yeah. knobs or something that came off of either the top of a lamp or like a handle of a dresser. That's all that's in here is a bunch of different <laughs> knobs. All right. All Somebody right. donated their knob collection. <laughs> <sighs> look at this. Money. Money, money, ways to make it and keep it in good times and bad. You know how to keep it right now? You don't spend $2,000 on a $50 storage unit. I've always looked up to giraffes. You know what? Ha. So does everybody else. They're tall. Uh, what else do we got in here, though? Dolphin. What is this? Is this even in here? <clears throat> Dang, look at that box. I don't know if it's in here. It looks like something we would find dumpster diving. I know. This is like a cooling pad to go under your laptop. Keep it cool. Another, uh, another vent. vent. <laughs> We're gonna keep it cool in here. We got vents, cooling fans. Um, what is this? Cherry Kiss lip balm. Lip balm. Another book. 
the perfect couple. Oh, aren't we? Aren't we? <laughs> <laughs> a moose and that. That's how I feel after I eat dinner. <laughs> and a bloated, here, a bloated tiger. <laughs> yes. We got a few pans and pots and things like that. This is the kitchen. Uh, uh, let's see. So, this is plates. Are these broken? No, they're not broken, but they're just a couple plates. Oh, what is that? Oh, look. A microphone scissor arm stand. Oh, cool. I had to give that baby Jesus. Yeah, you have like, is that the actual microphone or just a pop filter? It might know. just be a pop filter it comes with, but. Microphone scissor arm stand. I don't that's know. That's pretty cool, cool either which way. Yeah. And the only other things down here is a turtle, some more detergent. Uh, what is this? More detergent. It's making the bag smell good. Sweet love. And no, this. What is this for? I close this bag. This is cookware guards. I didn't even know they made some. Prevent like this. scratches. All right. I guess if you don't want scratches on your pan for some reason, you put gear on it. <laughs> cool bag. Next bag is right here. Let's see what we got in there. And we're starting off with a baby's Aww. reindeer costume. Yeah. Cozy deer. <laughs> And another VHS. Dead again. All right. Here's a mobster costume. <laughs> Gangster vest. All right. This is a fast track closet. Keeps taller stacked items from falling over. All right. I think those, <laughs> there's something else like that. Oh yeah, a wall. Those work, <laughs> it works very well too. Big red coloring book. Uh, this is like a bag with a pair of new socks okay. on it. A laptop case. A uh, laptop case. Here, you want some socks? Like for no. They got grapes on them. I don't want grape socks. <laughs> hey, look, headphones. What brand are these guys? It doesn't say. But, a pair of headphones. And then we got another book. Look at this guy. <laughs> don't laugh at him. Oh, I shot a zoom in on us. <laughs> Why? I don't know. It's hey, look, funny. Another router modem thingy. We have to look up the model and see what they are exactly. Let me find it. Or, look later this is a qc compact dvr camera pen what what <laughs> i know i gotta open this a camera pen a camera pen piqued our interest whoa so does this pen record let's see does it it might have a camera on all oh, the bottom of it's a camera isn't it huh i don't know this is weird hmm. it might be, gonna have to be look a, into that real yeah quick. it's got to be like some type of spy pen recording type the device. The papers in there? Yeah, all the papers are in here. Huh. That's cool. I'm setting that aside. This is going over here. This is like the art look through keep pile. <laughs> so we're going to keep for ourselves. What is this stuff? This is like one of those spike oh, it's rubber. I don't even know. It's a shower. It's something to do with a shower um, head. Th that's the shower head. Oh, it is. Look at that. That's a really square one. Shower heads are meant to be brown, not square. <laughs> Sorry. The fancy ones in expensive houses are square. No. A dog's jacket. Aw. Boo. Boo. <laughs> the sweater. Oh, what's this? Something in bubble wrap. Let's see what it is. Well, whatever it is, it's probably broken now. No, it's in bubble wrap. It's all right. No. I put all <laughs> my stuff in bubble wrap that goes to USPS, man. And they still find a way to break it, so... Uh, what is it? Come out. Come out. I see a first thing I see is getting mooned by someone. Oh. That's nice. Pretty round butt there. <laughs> That's an angel. <laughs> thanks. An angel that's just mooning everybody. Well, thanks. <laughs> Alright. Um, another speaker. Where do these speakers go to? <coughs> Trash. What is that? A waist trimmer? Looks like it. What is this? This is another, oh, pencil, pencil sharpener. sharpener, yes. These are the new age ones. Remember we used to have the ones on the wall in elementary school, you gotta be that one kid, I'll be back. <laughs> in the middle of the lecture, you're like, oh God. Yeah, like, start going slow, like, oh, nobody's hearing this, and they're like, come on, get it over with, sorry. Uh, basket. And then everybody's lives were saved by mechanical pencils. pencils. Yeah. All right, this is nice. Kill Alex Cross. All right, let's make a book about killing people. That's beautiful. Um, what else do we got in Poor here? Poor Alex Frost. I don't know what he did. Hey, look. A hair dryer and a vase. Give me your money. <laughs> uh, and, and a vase. This, is a ra this stuff is really random. 
Well, but hey, that's a pallet for a reason. Mr. Mr. Krabs, he's kind of smushed. Yeah, Mr. Krabs is a little smushed there, but he's there. His poor eyes. <laughs> what other stuffed animals are in here? This. Let's see if I recognize anyone else. Oh, what is this? Isn't he from a book? I don't know. I feel like he looks familiar from some book. Doesn't say on tag. Not that I saw. Cole's cares for kids. Oh. Polar bear. And then the rest mm. of them are just generic, like little. Oh no, there's a Yoda in there. Yoda. The rest of them though are just like generic random characters for kids, stuff like that. Nothing. Snakes. Yeah. Uh, is this an old like home phone thing? Looks like it, isn't yep. it? I remember having it and hating it so bad because then it would knock out the internet and you're like, oh my gosh. My first words, baby book. And what is this? Hmm. Whatever it is, it takes discs, it looks like. Is that what it does? It's upside down. It looks like yeah. it takes CDs in the top and then you can put like an iPod or something at the bottom. So it might just be like a radio or something. Yeah, MP3 compact disc player. There you go. There you go. <laughs> MP3. All right, that and well, that's just about it. So it's a pumpkin carving kit and a, a fanny pack. Second to last bag. You got a rabbit, a rabbit, and then we got what is that? A mattress bag for storage, I guess. A single swag, only one swag. That's just sad. <laughs> that. How many swag do you have? Infinity, <laughs> obviously. Hair dryer. <laughs> uh, a mini dog. You know why it's mini? Because it says mini. <laughs> uh, another mattress protector. Oh, look at this. Toddler book. Do I press it? No, it's going to make noises if it works. I don't want to do it. Oh, the most sought after Wii game in the history of Wii games. This game's like $10 trillion a piece. Yep. Easy. Definitely not found in dumpsters everywhere. What is this? Beauty. Is it lingerie, really? Who made a lingerie? <laughs> Racing costume. Should I go put it on? Yeah. Mm -hmm. No, don't have, don't anybody put that <laughs> in the comments. Nobody tell me to put that on in the comments, I swear. There's a helmet. Maybe this is a spot for like a GoPro or something. I don't know. Another costume. Another 1920s costume. flapper. All right. Well, let's that's from the 1920s. Here's our representation of society today. <laughs> Snowflake. Uh, a golf club thing. Why did I grab the bear like this? That's not nice. <laughs> I got this bear. Poor bear. This <laughs> Mary Meyer is the name of one of them. Um, what is that? Like a sheep bear? He looks weird, doesn't he? Yeah. What brand is he? Gund? G U N D? He's a gunner. That, oh no, I thought it was a piece of broken glass. Some swimming flippers. Oh, sweet. What is this? This is like a giant version. This is what the calculators are in. This is exactly what they are in. Or, normally, shoe Jeez. organizer. Yeah, but, you know, <laughs> that too. This little guy. Hey, we found that before. What? Two of those beers. That one, that one. Oh, look. And so the adventure begins. What is it? A photo of him? No, it's just a wallet. No money? Come on, man. That's messed up. Uh, what else do we have? Bunch of bears. I love you. Oh, thank you. I love you too. You can have somebody's used donated bear. <laughs> uh, that's a curler, isn't it? Yes. That's Very tiny one. Yeah. An owl beanie baby. Uh, a rabbit. VCU bag. Uh, what's this? A blanket. A fleece throw. Uh, what's that? <laughs> Somebody's used Listerine. <laughs> this is what we do it for. Actually, not used. No, yeah, the seal's closed, so no. Set of two paper towel holders. All right. A lot of brand new stuff. I'm surprised. Yeah, me too, actually. Uh, let's see. Hold on. There's another Target dog dressed as the Statue of Liberty. A blue Crayola crown costume. All right. All right. Mary Kay bag, makeup bag. It's like new. It's never even been used. Uh, ooh, is that a phone? Oh no, it's a screen protector. I was like, no way there's an iPhone in a mystery box. Uh, tape. We got baby toys. Whoa, look at that. 
a Fuji film, five times zoom, 14 megapixel camera, and it still has an SD card in it. Nice. Somebody forgot to remove it, so we'll put <laughs> a four gigabyte SD card in it. We're gonna have to find out what's on that, because I have one of the little flash drives. You put the SD card in, plug it right into your computer. Let's see, does this work? Uh, it doesn't cut on right now, but it's probably dead. Take batteries? Uh, it's probably, no, it's a charger. Yeah. yeah, it's a charger. Still, I'm gonna set that aside with the other thing. Um, what is that? Phone spa? What? The heck is that? I have no idea. I couldn't even begin yeah. to tell you. Yeah, I, I don't want to guess. <laughs> All right. Um, I thought I had a guess, but I don't want to sound retarded. Uh, man search for meaning. A picture frame. Is that a needle catcher? A what? That red thing. The thing they have in like doctor's offices. <laughs> That's what it looks like, isn't it? That's exactly what it is. Yeah, shark's after. collector. That's nice. It's new. Good. So, <laughs> the fishing line. PTSD with fishing stuff right now. I see Rapala. Oh, no. Rapala, tough line. More fishing stuff. Uh, DOA tags, really? All right, look. All right, Halloween. Okay. That makes us feel a little bit better. Other than that, you, know, you got a couple stuffed animals and just a couple of random books so we got a couple things that were also auctioned off that weren't pallets because we just wanted them we got these ugg boots ugg slippers i guess because they were there moccasins moccasins that's the word but there the you go. coolest thing i got you see this watch right just to watch look at the face that is a freaking rolex a rolex at goodwill <laughs> now is it real i don't know but what i'm thinking is we got to take this somewhere like a shop and get them to look at it and things like that. But we paid 20 bucks for it. And really it's worth the gamble to me because last time I found a fake one, I sold it for $50 anyway. So if it's fake, we make a little bit of money. If it's real, we make a small fortune. So <laughs> either which way you win 20 bucks for a Rolex watch. And I can't see the hands. I know one of the quickest ways to tell if it's working is the way the hand moves like a real Rolex, isn't it? It moves like this. And then a fake one's usually a tick. So, but the, it's not running right now. It's probably got a dead battery. So I don't know. We're going to take it somewhere and definitely get a check. But I just saw that in a jar and I was like, really? Is that a <laughs> Rolex at a Goodwill? So let's get into the last bag. So the last bag here, first off, look at this little blue box. I'm not sure what this is. I thought it looked interesting. Look, whatever this is, it's still in the plastic. Mm. I'm guessing this little thing, yeah, this thing turns and turns the pulley or the little gear inside. It but says something on my side. Does it? Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Or does it play the song? I don't know. That's like one of those... It. I know we don't want to play it, but that's like one of those rib things where like these little oh. pins hit the, and play the it? bubbles and play it. That might be exactly what that is, actually. That's definitely kind of weird and strange, something I've never seen before. That's I didn't cool. know what it was. But there's that. So, hold on, let's get into here. Ugh. Let's see what's in this box. Cherry Christmas. Nothing. Boo. Teddy bear. Ah. Got him. Yeah, you got me. I blinked. Uh, hold on. More diapers. By the way, that pair was in one of the bags too. It fell out in the truck. So we have a crap ton of diapers. <laughs> crap ton of diapers. <laughs> Probably just donate them. Um, we got purple bear and pink rabbit and Pikachu! Pikachu! The main reason we bid on this unit is because Pikachu. I saw Pikachu at the front. Was he old? He's from Build-A-Bear, it says. Whoa. But he does actually have an actual Pokemon tag on him, so it's not like some rebrand. But I didn't even know they had Pikachu there. Oh, look yeah. at his hand. It says some B-A-B -B or something. Does it feel like there's something in it? No. Oh, okay. It's just It's just Build-A-Bear. Yeah. Oh, B-A-B, Build-A-Bear, duh. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. B-A-D? B-A-B. B-A-B, yeah. Build-A-Bear. Yeah. A pan? <laughs> I didn't even think about it. What is that? This is Isaac. Yeah, jewelry Miserable. organizer, it looks like. Yeah, jewelry, that. makeup, whatever. All that. This is one of those shoe things. Didn't you just buy one of these? Yes, I did. Well, now you got Only for one, like right? three or four bucks, though. But now you got another one. Yeah. It's not like I'm going to have more shoes. <laughs> uh, baby toy. And this is like an American flag. Matt, was one of those things that hang outside, it looks like. Hangs like this. So pretty cool. Um, not too much in this bag. 
You got this big, it looks like a textbook. Top secret information the government banks and Ooh. retailers don't want you to know. I got an idea here that if there was top secret information they didn't want you to know, it wouldn't be available for sale in book form. But <laughs> that's just my guess. I don't know. I could be wrong. Um, I thought that was somebody's mail. I was like, really? Are these all like sewing patches? Yeah. This is like a whole bag of sewing patches. Look at that. A lot of them too. I mean, there's a bunch in there. <laughs> sewing kits. That's pretty cool. That's what, that's what that is too, huh? Yep. So we'll keep those over there together. What else is in here? This is More. another sewing thing. Is that what this is too? Also sewing. So that'll go over here. And let's see, planting gardens and graves. Seems a little dark, okay. but okay. And interesting. Oh, the case, the greatest game ever. Ah. <laughs> uh, and well, not too much else in here. We got whatever this is, a one person travel hammock. It's brand new. Cool. Look, tag still on it and everything. And another sh curler. Curler. Or dryer. <laughs> and the only other thing in there is the exact same thing as this, another rabbit. So now that we're in here, I want to talk about the watch a little bit. Now, if you watched the auction video yesterday, you would have seen that there was a total of four different Rolexes that went up for auction. Two of them had the clear back casing. Like the, if you see the back of the Rolex and it's clear, it's a guarantee that you have a fake, 100% fake. So we bid up to like 40 bucks on those because I know that's what I can get reselling it just by some crazy miracle that somebody replaced the back with a clear one and it could be real. I'd at least have my money back. This one, however, did not have that. It had the right markings on the back, which is what kind of intrigued me. So I've been doing like so much research about this little, so it's a ladies Rolex. And so far what I found is that everything is checking out. So for example, one of the biggest things I found on a hundred different websites to say to tell if it's real, two things. One is the time thing, the little thing you use to adjust it. Most of the fakes leave off the Rolex symbol. This one has the Rolex symbol on it. Two, the magnifier on the front. On the fake ones, you just usually a divot. Where on the real ones, it can actually, it actually magnifies the date on it. And if you look on the back of this watch, I can pull the number, it says Rolex 8570F, which is a model number. And when I look that model number up, it is a watch that looks very similar to this one online. And like I said, it's marked 18K on the back. So what was I thinking, 18K? What's the most logical thing to do? Let's scratch it on the acid tray. So we've got the watch scratched right here, and you're probably not gonna be able to see this, but this has been sitting here for like 10 minutes almost. And you can see 14 karat and 18 karat acid, just to test it. Neither one of them have done anything to that mark yet. Anything. Which is also a very good thing. So, I mean, it would be a chance in a million to find a legitimate, I mean, no, a chance in a billion to find a legitimate Rolex at the Goodwill. But I'm thinking tomorrow, since it's late now, now it's like 8 p.m., we'll find, maybe find one of those shops that do watches and jewelry, take it in and just see if, can you imagine that? That would be the craziest thing ever, this thing ended up being real. And see if it's real, because everything I'm seeing is checking out. So it's either real or really, really, really well done fake that hit all the little points that most of the counterfeits are missing. So I don't know right now. You guys let me know what you think and come back tomorrow because in the next video, we will take this somewhere and we will see if it's real or fake. Cross your fingers for us, please. If you enjoyed it, leave it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and make sure you come back next time.